happy people i'm back with another video and i'm excited because i'm going to be showing you all some new colors that madame lamb has added to their winter collection here is my package they let me pick out five colors from their new snowy layover um collection they recently released and these are the colors that i got you guys so i'm going to show you all what they look like up close and get them swatched for you the first color that i have here is ready set ski and this is like a absolutely beautiful royal blue color just like a really nice royal blue love this color a lot okay so we have that color y'all know i'm really into nudes these days so i did pick up oh dear absolutely loving the names of this collection in this collection too really really um season appropriate so this here is a really nice nude color really like that a lot okay i also picked out feeling pine <laughs> okay loving the play on words there and this is a really ooh, it's a nice like deep kind of uh i don't even know the nice deep green color but not like super like forest green but just like a, I don't know how to really describe it kind of a deep turquoise green maybe I don't know but it's really pretty so I picked that up to go along with oh dear I picked up shellat time or shellat time I'm not sure if I'm saying that right but this is a really beautiful reflective kind of rose gold nude color absolutely beautiful love that color a lot okay it's funny it actually kind of looks like this um this chrome nail I have on here, so that's really nice. Last but not least, I picked up Oh What's Fun, okay? And so this is a really nice black reflective polish. And I decided to get a black reflective because I actually don't have anything like this in my collection. And so, yeah, y'all, these are the colors that I picked out. I'm gonna go ahead and get these colors swatched out for you guys so you can see how they look. Y'all know I love Madame Glam polishes because they are one coat coverage. Okay, happy people. I am absolutely loving this Christmas collection that Madame Glam came out with. Um, they also had like four other glitters in the collection that I really wish I had have gotten. And so, yeah, if you guys are interested in getting your hands on it, I am going to leave um, the link to their website in the description box as well as my discount code here on the screen. This is what all the colors are looking like swatched out. Um, so this is what Oh Dear looks like. It's a really beautiful, gorgeous nude color. I've really been into nudes lately, so I really like this one. Next one here is Shellat Time, and this is a really pretty, a pinky reflective color. Next we have Feeling Pine, which is a really beautiful green. It's like a off green color, which I really like. Next we have Ready Set Ski, which is probably my favorite um, from the ones that I chose. This is really beautiful vibrant royal blue color oh what fun which is a fun hollow black glitter reflective polish so yeah y'all um i want to see if i can try to get the reflectiveness to show up this kind of gives you guys an idea of what that reflectiveness will look like i don't know if y'all can really see it all that great let's see i don't know but yeah and yeah if you all are interested about how i got these sets i am going to leave full tutorials to both of them link down in the description box below i'm gonna go ahead and pop off one of these nail sets and we're gonna get into a look okay happy people i am back and i'm super excited because today i'm going to be dedicating this nail set to the launch of my new ain't she cute though merch and so yeah y'all i'm gonna be doing a set of press on nails so that i can wear them over and over and over again okay i'm super excited for this set and um i actually have a new way of prepping my press on nails so i just wanted to share that with you all i'm gonna go in with 100 acetone and that's gonna essentially etch the tips you guys know i don't really I'm not a big fan of like buffing the tips. I just feel like that's a lot of extra work. So I'm gonna go in with some acetone and etch the surface of the nails. Actually, even before I do that, just really quickly, I'm gonna go in and file the tops, these little tips off the nails. Okay, so I'm gonna take my acetone and pour it in a bottle here. Next, I'm gonna take just any old brush cleanser and I'm gonna take the brush from it and then I'm going to dip it inside of the acetone here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna scrub that acetone into the nail tip and I'm gonna keep doing it until it feels kind of a little bit sticky and that's gonna let me know that it's kind of being etched if that makes sense. So I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna just keep rubbing it like that. And you all see how the surface of it is starting to look a little discolored and a little sticky. That's how I know that I'm etching that tip. Okay, so we're just gonna go ahead and do that. So then this one is ready to go. So I'm gonna go through and repeat that process on all the nails. And 
And then when I'm done using it, I will just put the brush back into the bottle. Now all of my tips have kind of sort of been etched in a sense, chemically etched. And then next thing I'm gonna do is go in with my Young Nails Protein Bond and apply that to all the nail tips. And that's just gonna allow for better adhesion to whatever product you put on top. So I'm gonna go ahead and add Protein Bond to all the nails. Alrighty, so this is what all the nails look like after prep. Now I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my color of choice. I'm gonna do a white base on all of the nails and I'm gonna be going in with my white from McCart and Blanc. And I'm gonna go in with two layers of this. I've added two layers of the polish as well as a top coat. And I went ahead and moved my pinky nail over here um, just so that I have more like mobility to be able to do nail art on it. And so I'm gonna show you guys the two designs of the shirts that I have. So this is the first design. Let me zoom out a little bit. And my goal with this is to replicate the text on here. So the ain't she cute though part, that's what I want to actually draw on the nail set itself, okay? So majority of the inspiration is gonna come from this shirt. And from my second design, right, I want to um, do the though part. So yeah, so the though part, I wanna try to bring that to life on the nails as well. So I wanna try to do a combination of the two. And yeah, y'all, let's see how we can bring this set to life, okay? So that means I gotta do a lot of freehand nail art. You guys know that um, doing letters on nails is actually one of my weak points. And so I wanna challenge myself to do that with this particular set. Yeah, y'all, let's hop into this. Um, I am gonna be using my micro detailer brush from Young Nails. This is the new one that I recently got in the Black Friday box and I'm so excited to put it to use. Y'all know this is like my favorite nail art brush. I'm gonna be going in with Madam Glam in Perfect Black, Madam Glam Polish in um, the Oh What Fun, okay, and this is from the new line. I might be using Shellat Time from the new collection as well, so we'll see how everything comes together. And then I also plan to use this pink liner in um, 201 from Joss Love. So these are the items I'm gonna be using for the nail art. And yeah, y'all, let's see what we come up with. So I'm gonna speed through me doing this design because it's gonna take me forever to do. And while I do that, I'm gonna give you all some life updates and kind of tell you all more about the t-shirt launch. Okay, happy people. So as I'm drawing this, I want to give you all a quick life update. You all, first I want to start off with my life outside of YouTube. Holy moly. Uh, life has been crazy the last half of 2022. Um, I've been doing a lot of traveling and it's been, you know, absolutely phenomenal. I've been loving it. I've even had a chance to like go home and, you know, spend a week with my family during Thanksgiving. That was amazing and definitely a much needed break. I was able to get some rest, which was really nice. Um, and I have shared a few of my travel adventures with you all, and I'm hoping to share even more. There's a few trips that I took. I have like small vlogs that I made with some nail tutorials. So I'm hoping to just get those edited. It's just a matter of finding the time to do it, but I promise those videos are coming soon. And then also I actually have started a new career path um, and then I'm, I'm super excited about it. You know, I'm currently taking classes to get more knowledge and information um, in the IT industry um, to create a better future for, you know, both myself and my family. And so I'm working on getting a certification so that I can start that new career path. So that is why I have kind of been MIA a little bit on social media in regards to like, you know, being interactive I, I feel like i used to be more engaged um you know with leaving comments and being able to stay up to date on people's content and things like that but just with you know taking class and trying to tend to my little one and um now the launch of this um of my merch it's you know it's kind of hard to stay on top of everything and then also just not being home <laughs> has contributed to that as well but i just you know wanted to uh give you guys an update about like life and what's been going on um even my little one i had to do the whole process of switching her and getting her into a new daycare which by the way the new one is working out great <laughs> i had issues with the old one in the past but Anywho, I'm rambling a little bit. Um, so yeah, I recently launched my new merch, y'all. Ain't she cute though? Oh my gosh. Ain't she cute though? Yes, y'all. Thank you all so much for the inspiration, for the uh, motivation to do something like this. I'm beyond excited um if you all have not seen that announcement video i am going to link it down below but wow you guys what a journey youtube has been i never thought 
like my passion of doing nails would actually turn into something so big you know and when i started documenting my journey a year and a half ago i did not know that it would just turn into this into something so amazing yeah y'all so the idea of how these shirts came to be was quite interesting so back in january of this year i actually had the idea to create some shirts with this uh phrase on it but I was like, oh, I don't know if people would even care to buy this. And so I was like, ah, and then I just kind of let it go. And then it's so crazy, but a few weeks after that, I had multiple subscribers saying that I should create a shirt with this phrase on it. And so y'all, my creative juices got to work and boom, eight, nine months later, here we are. Okay, so yeah, that's how these shirts came to be. And um, I'm excited for the launch of the website as well. This is only the beginning, you guys. Um, I'm starting off my website with merch and um, eventually I would like to be able to offer nail supplies, you know, um, even maybe my own nail products you know there's there's this one product i'm i'm wanting to bring to the market so it's going to be a long time before that happens but i'm in the process of doing research and working with different labs to try to make that a thing and also too i want you all to be a part of this process so let me know in the chat as well as down in the comments below what do you all want to see from me what type of products um would you all like to see on the website what type of products would you like for me to offer and I could get to working on that, you know? Um, I want it to be something that you all would be interested in. Um, and so, yeah, let me know. I'm definitely open for feedback and suggestions. And yeah, I just, I wanna give a special thank you to, um, like I said, my happy family, to everyone who is continuing to support me, who's been there from the very beginning, um, who's just rooting for me, man. I just, I appreciate y'all so much. And um, I also need to give a huge, huge, huge um, shout out to my husband. I need to take time to appreciate him right now, y'all. He has been my rock through all of this. I have been going through so many different transitions, like I mentioned earlier, and he has just been there through it all and just, you know, there for me during those nights where I'm just up all night crying, trying to figure out what the next step is, what the next move is. He is just so great and I appreciate you, babe. If you're watching this, I appreciate you, babe. Thank you so much for um, just being there, you know, just being there and believing in me, this vision, um, and for just helping me to just get everything in order, everything set up, dealing with vendors, headache with all the shipping delays, babe, all of that stuff. Uh, yes, I, I know it's been a stressful process for you, but I appreciate all that you've done to help me get to where I am right now and pushing me to become the greatest version of myself. I love you, babe. So yeah, y'all, I had to take a moment and shout out babe because he, he been holding it down, okay? <laughs> So yeah, overall, you guys, I just, the support has been like, wow, you know, I could literally cry right now, but I just want to say thank you again to everyone that's been on this ride with me and, um, and also a special thanks to everyone who's placed an order thus far. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited for y'all to get y'all shirts. I have poured my heart into this line. So I really hope that y'all enjoy it. Um, I shipped out my first batch of orders yesterday. And then I got a few more orders that I'm planning on shipping out here soon. If you guys want to see updates on everything that's happening, like behind the scenes and things like that, you can follow my um, Ancient Cute Though Instagram page. And so, yeah, y'all, I think that's all the updates I have right now. But let me stop rambling. I've been talking. Let's get back into this set. I already finished drawing Ancient Cute Though. So I'm going to get into how I did stamping on the thumbnail and yeah we'll get into the finished look okay so this final two nails are going to be a special message to you all my happy family so um i want to do this youtube symbol and i want to do dream big and this is going to be your encouragement your motivation your sign if you all have been wanting to do youtube if you all have been wanting to get started if you all have been nervous scared unsure this is your sign to say go for it and do it because i was in, i was in the same boat not too long ago so yeah y'all so let me go ahead and hop into this design i am going in with my born pretty stamping polish okay in dark armor so i'm gonna just take a generous amount of the polish onto the plate i'm gonna do a quick swipe down like so I'm going to use my stamper to roll and pick up. 
after I picked up the image, I'm gonna take my lint roller and remove what I don't need. And I am gonna try just a little bit of reverse stamping. So I'm gonna take a little bit of this polish. I'm just gonna go ahead and fill in the YouTube sign just to make it a little bit more opaque. Okay, so that's the image I have. Now I'm gonna put it on the nail. Perfect transfer, okay. This plate, I'm gonna go on with Dream Big. And I'm gonna use the black. Saturate the image, quick swipe down, pick up. So this is the finished set. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and apply these to my nails, throw some cuticle oil on, and we gonna get it to the finished look, okay? All right, you guys. Ain't she cute though? Yes, baby. This set is so cute. I am absolutely loving it, y'all. And then again, this nail, it is dedicated to everybody out there who is starting their YouTube journey and um, are feeling discouraged or don't know where to start. My advice to you is to just do it, you guys. Dream big. Anything is possible. Dream big, you guys. The sky is the limit and only you are holding yourself back from reaching your fullest potential and reaching greatness. So yeah, go for it. See what'll happen. Y'all, I'm absolutely loving how this set turned out. Yes, how did I do, y'all? Did I did I nail it? Did I nail it or did I nail it, though? Is she cute or is she cute, though? Okay, yes! Okay, y'all. <laughs> absolutely loving how this set turned out. Let me know what you guys think about it down in the comments below. I'm going to leave my website as well as my Ain't She Cute, though. Um, Instagram link down in the description box below so you all can stay up to date on any new product releases um, and just stay up to date on what I got going on. I, I packed a couple of orders. I definitely want to give a huge thank you to everybody who's ordered thus far. Um, I really appreciate your support. Um, this is why I am doing this for you all. So thank you so, so much. Um, yeah, I see y'all. I see y'all. Y'all came and y'all showed out. So I appreciate it so much. And for this website, this is only the beginning. I do hopefully plan to expand and also sell nail supplies and different nail products um, possibly even some press-ons and so yeah y'all let me know what y'all like to see um, from my shop in the future any suggestions and feedback is welcomed and so yeah y'all let me know what y'all think about my mani have y'all shopped the site yet and which design is your favorite is it the one with the hand or without the hand so yeah y'all I do upload every Tuesday Thursday and Saturday Thursdays in particular are my nail therapy Thursday premieres where I tune in live with you all as you watch me do my nails and if you all like what you saw here definitely stick around join the happy family I'd love to have you and as always you guys leave some love in the comments down below and i'll see you in my next video i hope you all have a wonderful awesome spectacular day bye